All right, hello, my name is Chris Evans. This is the reassessment for the position, velocity, and acceleration um, reassessment. And um, this is a, 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 a adaptation from the second problem. Um, I got the first one right, so I'm pretty sure I proved myself on that one. But um, this one, I just wanted to prove to you that um, I actually know how to do it. So, All right, so there, basically there's a helicopter, as you can probably see in the email. There's a helicopter that's going... 50 miles per, uh, I'm sorry, 50 meters per second, um, directly east, and then it comes up on an area where the wind, or um, there's a wind speed of five meters per second going um, directly east of north, and um, blowing in at a 45 degree angle. So, um, and um, the second picture is actually the correct one, if you can see it right there. But, um, so anyway, the, um, so there's the plane and everything, I mean the helicopter going uh, about 50 meters per second directly to the east. And so basically what you do is, um, in order to find the um, velocity um, from the ground, is you, uh, you would have to define a cosine of 45 because its uh, cosine is adjacent over hypotenuse. So cosine is, um, cosine, so the adjacent part would be the ground of course. And then, um, and then the hypotenuse would be the error um, would be the error five meters per second, which I have right here in this formula, um, which is uh, if you can't read it's five meters per second times cosine of forty five, and then you also have to add the um, the actual velocity the helicopter is going in since we're, uh, it is from the ground, which is fifty meters per second, and then um, that's x hat, so it's um, so it's five meters per second times cosine of forty five plus fifty meters per second x hat. And then for the y, it's um, you just do sine of 45. Um, so um, let's see, um, sorry, it's supposed to be sine of 45 right there, not cosine of 45. So um, I mean not not sine of 30, sine of 45, right there. And then um, in order to I mean. Uh, but that's just the y value vertically, so I guess that doesn't really matter. But so anyway, um, my final answer for the velocity according to the ground is I got 53.5 meters per second x hat plus 2.50 meters per second y hat. That's my answer right there. So um, so like I said, basically just um, so yeah, in order to find it uh, according to the ground velocity um, from from the ground. It's cosine of 45, which is the angle that the wind is blowing, and then um, times the wind wind velocity, and then you have to add the helicopter velocity as well because it's going directly east. And um, so my final answer, like I said, is 53.5 meters per second x hat plus, and then from the y direction, it's 2.50 meters per second y hat, and that's it. Thank you.